Yo, what up, guys? Mr. Grutz here, back from MBR, Scar uh, MBR Starcast. Some more live League of Legends gameplay for you guys today. Um, today I'm going to be playing as Jarvan in the top lane. Um, first time I've ever actually tried Jar- uh, Oh, I actually have to put this. She at the... Um, the Cassiopeia on their team is Diamond 1. Um, so I'm I'm interested to see how that goes. And Cassiopeia against Nindy, I'm sure it's gonna be quite a hard lane. I think this is the highest person. I, I went against the Diamond Free Vein myself, and I think there's I've gone against a Diamond Free Blitzcrank who actually jungled, I believe. Um, so I, I'm interested to see how this is. The Diamond one, I think it's the highest person I've actually been like sort of teamed up against. Obviously, I'm not facing up against her, but I'm sure I'm sure we'll um, meet uh, along the way. Um, so I was, that's why I was a bit excited at the start, I was trying to put that in to let her know that she's uh, against her. They're all pre-mades on my team, bar myself, um, and their team's all, well that was weird, um, their team's all pre-mades bar Jinx, so we'll see. Um, the highest person on my team is, uh, Vayne, who's gold free. <laughs> they have a diamond one. Ah, uh, not a fucking Lee Sin. Um, I kind of just was like, fuck it, you know. I knew Lee Sin was there, I was like, no, either I can try and flash and get away, or I just try and fuck him up. Yes, Jinx, go on, son. Go on. Yes, that's it. Go on, go on. Nice. Jinx jungle, OP. <laughs> um, nice. You know, I'm, I'm really happy with that, you know. Couldn't really... Um, not necessarily the best start ever, because obviously I died, but, you know, um... I'm going to sell a pot just so I can buy a ward, uh, just in case Lee Sin comes again. As I say, they're all pre-made, so I'm expecting sort of Lee Sin to babysit, um, maybe to uh, flip in rhythm if she keeps getting beat like me. That was really good damage, like I said, I've never tried Jarvan out, I was like, a bit excited because I was so surprised that they have a um, Diamond 1 on their team. I'm interested to see how this Jinx jungle goes, oh, if that speared hit, don't do it, she'll kill you. Um, that spirit here could mean a whole different story, but yeah, that damage we did is really nice. I think I'm gonna. Wow. Oh, that was bot. I was not the hell that, that was all about that. Um, I'm interested to see how this goes. Our damage so far is really OP. Um, drop a ward down just in case he ever comes. Uh, I'm a bit worried about how my mana. I was gonna go for like a um, flipping. I think what gives you mana, a flask. But we'll see. I might have to go for like a frozen heart or something. Might not be bad. Yeah, actually, yeah, it'd be quite good actually. Think about it. Riven Jinx, Nisa. Uh, so we'll see what we get up to. Obviously, we got first blood. I burnt my flash to get it because I wasn't sure, or I just kind of didn't want to be in the situation where I've kind of done what I'd done, and I just wanted to make sure that I, I got that kill because I'd have been so gutted had. Uh, you know, I died and not got the kill, so I was happy to trade my flash to get that, you know. It's all good. That's never good though. AP, uh, minion. Um. So what's, oh, what the fuck? Hacks. AP hacks. Uh, don't know my rune's gone. I'm walking about. I'm a bit worried, uh, uh, she's only like, just in lane, so she's back, maybe she's back to get a ward, possibly. Um, I'm scaling up my E because it gives me armor and attack speed, I don't know if it's best, that's what I go for in the jungle and it seems to work well, so, we'll see. Um, I guess she did back, I don't know what she got, it was either that Doran's Blade or the Longsword, I can't remember. So she's going for that quite early aggression. Um, I think I might go for the Frozen Heart just because it reduces attack speed, which could be a good against like Jinx, really. And also um, for the mana, that, that's what I'm really concerned about. I even get the flask, and I feel maybe it's a bit too late to get the flask now. I should have like, been my opening item, possibly. 
Um, damage we do is jokes. Really pleased with as a sort of uh, open and start, especially that kill we got. And the thing, what I, the reason what kind of drew me to Jarvan is I really enjoy him in the jungle and the fact that I can pretty much guarantee that I will make her flash if I ult. Unless she can cure E out of it, which I do. I don't know, she might be able to. I have to wait, uh, wait and see, but see at the moment I'm having a bit of troubles uh, with mana, so just gotta keep that in mind. Obviously, she has her ultimate up now, which does make her probably stronger than me, but once I back, I'll be able to buy like a nice uh, advantage. Oh, please do not die. Da -da -da. Nidalee, these pre-mates, uh, it's, uh, Cassiopeia's here, where the fuck is Nidalee drawing all this? She doesn't even respond, like, OP pre-mates here, obviously have no communication between ourselves. Nidalee just didn't even react to that. Um, I was quite disappointed, really. At least I didn't die, I was kind of worried that I might get caught out in the jungle then, but, um, yeah, I'm a bit slow, I can't think of where I'm frozen, there we go. Uh, I'll get that just purely as I can't afford anything else. Ah, oh, shit, I didn't realise they can't buy any wards. <laughs> um, not to worry, I just have to kind of play it cool. Um, so yeah, you know, I, was, I didn't really have much mana to do anything, and I was only really trying to go over there just to try and make sure Jinx got away, but unfortunately she did die, so I lose a bit of CS. That Riven will have a CS lead over me now, and I probably, I, I, if I'd done anything, I would have died, so it was certainly not uh, worth it. We'll see what we can do now. We have some mana. Um, I don't know. I think I need to get some more art. Well, we got the other cloth armor, but could have went for the chain vest, but I wouldn't be able to get the uh, sapphire crystal. She's scared of me. I have no wards, which I have to kind of be really careful about. How's Jinx feed Jinx? Is it? Oh no, Jinx is jungle. Yeah, I forgot about that. I said I just really have to be careful about least income because I haven't got any wards and I'm pushing, which kind of worries me. I think they've got better more communication. Well, obviously I can't communicate really with my team. You know, Lee Sin was just bought, so this is like my time to go. Like, whoa, damage. Nice. I don't know. She even taken flash. She has. I haven't seen a flash once this game. Jinx signaling tops missile. Uh, don't know how she worked that one out. <laughs> uh, good job to. Um, good job uh, to Jinx though. There, that was um, a really nice gank. I wasn't sure if Riven warded, but I guess she hadn't. So, kind of make her pay for not warding. Um, I'm just take these golems quickly. I'm making a nice ultimate use. Whoa, who got what? It's really confusing having two jinxes on my team. Um, so yeah, we make a nice gank. Or, um, Jinx makes a nice gank camp. First time I've seen Jinx jungle. Oh, she, she's right, no way. Nice. First time I've seen it. Um, some of you guys on YouTube, oh, my channel would be nice. It's been for me to try it out. I will give it a go, but I just haven't kind of got around to uh, doing it yet. Um, once I complete my Frozen Heart. Um, once I complete my Frozen Heart, I think I'll be able to easily duel with her. I need like a Brutalizer or something as well. And the Hydra, it's been quite nice. Um, so yeah, I think we're pretty comfortable. We've got a 2 kill lead. You know, she's... I don't know, we'll see. I'll have to wait and see, won't we? Um, I just, she hasn't flashed, like both times she could have flashed. I didn't think she did the first time. And my flash was up, so she, her should have been. Um, so I don't know, I'm going to scare up my Q next. I can't remember what my W does, I know it gives me some kind of shield and I think it slows them. Did I get the big one? I don't think I did. I'm pretty disappointed if I didn't. That always sucks. At least we have a ward now as well, which is nice. Handy. Um, hmm. Let's see. She seems to be doing some nice damage still. I think that life steal. I need to probably get some life steal myself or something, maybe. 
don't want to get caught out. Because if I use my EQ combo like that, you know, I, I can overextend and all she has to do is stun me and ult me. I could flash, but I take a. I don't really want to just like burn my flash for uh, no reason. But now she actually missed her uh, stun there. It kind of makes it quite weak. But I have no pots, and I really feel I need that chain vest. But I don't want to die with knowing that I could have bought that chain vest and I'm not I not have it and then you know I die, I'd be pretty annoyed with myself really. Hopefully oh, I didn't know that. Um I don't want to really just ward just yet because I really kinda of wanna back and get this chain vest we are. That level on CS. Just cool. Um, she's regenerating a lot of health. I don't know if she has any quints of lifesteal or something. It seems pretty OP just for a Dorrance Blade and a Lamp Scepter. Um, so yeah, maybe I will complete my lot. Oh. We get out here. Who we will. Just about. That's probably why I should have warded, but it's cool. Um, not the end of the world really. At least I didn't die. So there's two of them. I'm pretty sure they cancelled my knock up or something, haven't I? I don't know. I don't really know what happened. <laughs> I just lose track what happens on the Legends. Shit, time just goes by so quickly. Um, hmm. Alright, so I've been able to complete my uh, my Glacial Shroud, which I didn't think I was going to do. I just wanted to get my Chain Vest and my Vamp Scepter, um, which I've got. So I've got that. Completed now, which is nice because the cooldown gives me cooldown. I, f I forgot about that. That's really nice, actually. That makes it even more uh, useful. Um, so obviously it gives me cooldown, which is nice. And I have no hell pots now, so I've kind of got to be careful on that. You know, I've got the vamp scepter, but with no hell pots means that I probably won't be able to sustain out on two lanes. So I might have to make another back shortly. But we're level on CS, and I have two kills, so which is cool. Um, let's see. I dropped my ward down in a second. I know these things bottom, so. I can kind of just, you know, keep it for a couple more seconds, just so, you know, I have it last a little bit longer, um, and I don't really want to back just yet, I want to at least be able to buy something else when I back, possibly like some, I don't know, yeah. I could possibly complete my Frozen Heart, I think it might be like 500 gold, I haven't the, got the Frozen Heart in such a long time, normally I, really? She can do it then. Oh, what the fuck? Either my ultimate was really bad, or she just did it. <laughs> um, well, that kind of really sucked. Now I'm pushing quite hard, I have to wield. Damage was nice though, that was what we wanted though. I think this uh, Glacial Shroud and Fingy Majiggy uh, Lamp Scepter's helped us out a bit. She <laughs> lands some of my flipping skill shots. Oh, I guess they are skill shots. Do we have to land them? Um, I just want to keep Riven here because of what's going down. Over here. Are we going to be alright? I just need. Did I get Ignite on him? I did, but Riven got the kill anyway. <laughs> uh, Jinx got the kill. Do you not get stunned, whatever you do. Of course she did. Of course. Dude, come on, come on, come on, come on. She gonna do it? Mini guy, mini guy, mini guy, mini guy. Um, hmm. I don't know, it was a free for free overall. Oh no, it wasn't. It would have been a free for two. Because Nidalee's bot. No. Who died? What? No, yeah, it was a. Yeah, it was for a free for free. Um, so we kind of basically just traded kills. Like, I gave Riven a kill, and Cascade also got a kill for the sake of Jinx getting two kills. So maybe it really makes our OP jungle. I don't know, we'll have to wait and see. I, yeah, like, obviously, it gives Riven a kill now, so that could make her a bit stronger for this top lane. Um, we'll have to wait and see. Um, I've been able to get a couple of pots. Complete my frozen heart now, which is nice. Yeah, it's a lot of armor. Obviously, twenty percent cooldown now, which is even better. Reduce the attack speed of Ruin, which is alright, I guess. 
Um, so she picked up a first kill. We'll level on CS. Um, she does have a tier map now. No, Nidhi getting caught out. I just want to farm top, but Nidhi's being crazy. She deserved to die. It's uh, uh, and what she was doing. I wanted to alt rhythm, but it's not really probably worth it. Um, so who got that kill? At least Riven did. Yeah, I think Cassiope got it. Honestly, don't know what she didn't need to. Do. She just didn't need to do that. It was just silly. She warded this. I think she has warded this. She doesn't have a ward on her anymore, so I guess she has. I can't believe she got my ult last time. That was jokes. My ward just died as well. That sucks. Be careful, Lee Sin coming. The thing is, if I go aggressive, my EQ coming. So uh, it's all open to gank, especially when Lee Sin comes out quick ears and mids missing. And oh, they're all bot actually. Uh, my knight's almost up, so I'm trying to kind of bait it out for. She just the life steal she has is really kind of annoying. She just seems to regen all the damage I do. To her. If I get my knock up though, that's pretty nice. Don't know what's happening there. Three of us dead for nothing. Try and bait this out for my ignite, but the problem is I've kind of damaged her quite a bit. She might just back. Ten seconds. Just wait for it. A recoil to get down a bit. OP baits. Now our ultimate's up. Well, our ultimate's already up, but ignite's up as well. And there we go. She got greedy, she should have recalled like she was, was able to, I, the reason I, whoa, fucking no, <laughs> shit, this couldn't have went any worse, once his Q's gone though, I'm away from this, I have flash up, so, unfortunately for him, uh, Lee isn't diamond one standard, gold five though, but, where is Diamond? Yeah, I forgot Cascopio was Diamond 1. I just mean, she fought a 2. And Nidhi's out farming her. It's not been Nidhi. I think Nidhi's only died once, but. Ah, what do we turn this into then? Hmm, I might go for a Hydra like she's going for. Seems pretty cool, to be honest. This pickaxe might be able to spike my damage up a bit. Um, I'm really enjoying Jarvan in this top lane, though. Uh, really been good fun. We've done well, you know, we we beat him Riven, she's won the four with three to two, three assists. She's got three assists as well though, but yeah, I'm just kind of interested to see what's going over the board. Because Jinx has got a lot of kills whilst Vayne's only got one whilst there. Jinx has got three. I don't know. Kind of Jinx is more not necessarily about ganking more of just being a big threat in the team fights, I guess. Um Riven is going Mid, so I just don't want them to fucking die to her. If they do, I'd be so annoying because I've told them as well. So, <laughs> so much that she's coming down there. Um, so yeah, we're looking good. Ignite would be almost back up. That's kind of quite quick to be honest with us. She actually has a Hydra, but. Oh, that's bad. Yeah, we're definitely a lot stronger now with this pickaxe. Uh, she just has no different armor. How much armor does she have? 64 whilst we have 194. Well. There's this Lee Sin kicks over here. Um, that's all good. How's he numb? Did you just kiss her or something? I don't know what he's doing. Again, I just don't want them dying. Mm, the 
flashes. Oh, of course, oh, of course. Oh no, so fuck. So fuck. Nice flash by Lisa then. It's kinda quite out of position just because Jinx got quite out of position, so I had to go over and defend her and you know because of that. <coughs> Unfortunately I died. Um I was gonna ult them to stop her getting her, but she just died anyway, so it didn't really make a difference. I lose my top lane now because of that. Which is a bit annoying really. Um because she got caught out, you know, it just cost me my life. And my turret, and now Riven has an additional kill on better CS. So everything that I didn't want to happen has now happened. Free, free, free. Not bad. What's going on then? I still think I'm stronger than Riven, which is unfortunate now. Like in that 2v1 situation, there wasn't really much I could do because I didn't have enough HP. And, you know, I was hoping that I'd catch uh, Leeson out with my ultimate. I almost did, but. It wasn't to be. These guys gonna be alright? Or should I can try to go top? I just wanna go top. I just don't want them to die on me or anything crazy. Um, so I just need to farm really and get my Hydra as quick as possible because it should give me a massive uh, damage spike. That's the plan anyway. But unfortunately for me, I've lost my turret now, which really kinda. Sucks, which means my laning phase is kind of been to be over with now. So we won't be able to get like mass amount of CS anymore. Just kind of odd bits and pieces. Uh, so we are level with CS on Riven, which is good. But no. Oh, how much do we need here? I can get there. We need an uh. Like 300. Um, just kind of roam around now, really. Uh, let's see what happens. Where's Cassie being 44? My Jan is so low. I'm trying to keep my ult up. Why is Jan even coming back? This. <laughs> like, what the fuck? I don't think I'm gonna get away from this. Cassiopeia was on the other side of the wall anyway, already. Um, I was keeping my ult up just for the sake, because it wasn't really point in using it. Um, so we just have no damage or anything, really. Vayne's just like worthless. Um, so, I, you know, luckily I could keep my ult up and it allowed me to kill Lee Sin, so it was kind of a trade of the kill for it. Uh, kill for my death. I could have kind of. Oh, I was trying to like uh, EQ over the wall, but obviously with Jinx slow and Cassiopeia was on the other side anyway, so it was going to be a pretty much a difficult job, really. Um, oh, I get some health on me now, really. Try and tank myself up a little bit. Um, four, four, four. Sure, even numbers this game. Well, I'm not say even on the same numbers. Um. So I don't know what to say. Don't know. Cassie, uh, where's their jinx? I just, I don't, I don't know. I think their team's looking stronger than ours. We just don't seem to have like massive amount of damage. Like, because Vayne's just not got anything going for us. So. I have no ult here. But nice ult by Janna. If they can get the kill, surely. Can pick up a. <laughs> Come on team. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Where is the team? What are they doing? Why she left me? What the fuck? I don't believe they just stopped targeting me. I think Riven was there or something maybe. Two for one as long as no one dies now I guess. I was just hoping the team was with me but Lane has no damage. Literally she has nothing. She <laughs> does no damage whatsoever. Um, I can't believe Janna got away. Fair play to her. They have OP support. That's a good job. At least we killed the diamond one. 
Fuck that bitch up. <laughs> I made my day, that's all I need to do. I might as well just get AFK, AFK now. I need to get some magic resist before I get my warm Complete my Mercury treads just to kind of helps with stuns and stuff. I'm pretty sure it does. If I'm, oh yeah. I'm gonna make sure I'm chatting shit. Um, I'm obviously magic resist nice and so forth, so. And additional movement speed. They've just got dragon. Nothing we can do. Don't have a, the ward control. You know, we did, we were so, like, low after that fight anyway. Um, let's see what Nidhi's up to. Hopefully, she has, uh, she's gonna have some nice heals and uh, spears. We can win it for us, really, as long as we play safe and use that to our advantage. With that poke of hers. And there should be hope, but I don't know what she's doing. Looks like she's about to get fucked up. Maybe not. Maybe she. She can get away, how it seems. Bit slow on the old uh, ward there. What are these guys up to? Motherfucking, this is so crazy. That's so one thing I really do like about uh, Jalvin is that E is really nice. I think I would definitely be playing them again top lane. Definitely. Really good fun. I think we have no wards. Literally have no ward control. Even in our own just even in our own jungle. It's just like just defensive wards. I don't want any aggressive wards. Just so we can see who's in our jungle, but we have nothing. And Alistar is just the only ward we have. Oh, it was mine, but it got killed. Oh, little bitches. They've got, maybe they pink ordered it, possibly. I don't think anyone's got an aura. Oh, uh, Janna might. I think Janna actually has an aura, of course. Um, so yeah, without this uh, ward control, we just, like, even if Janna kills them, at least we can just have something, just to give us some vision, because we don't have a clear what's going on. Which is not good. And we have no damage either. And kill. Oh, this would be really nice. I say we have no flipping damage to kill her. What the fuck? Oh my god. Why can't I have the flipping diamond one? Why are they always got to be on the enemy team? Just have no damage on our team. It just sucks. I don't know anyone who actually like doesn't even. My damage is not amazing. Just altered Cassiopeia you now, getting rid of the main target, they were split, and it wasn't enough, unfortunately. Why did I have to get these premates? I wish I had their premate team. I want a diamond to carry me. Bane has just no damage. Literally. It's not good. And Nidley, like, I don't know, they just, there's no damage on our team comp. And Jinx is pretty fed, so I don't know why we don't have any. Just, <laughs> we just can't seem to kill anyone. It just sucks. And we have no wards. Look at that's just sitting base. We have no turret, like, oh, we do have mid. Oh, it's only my turret, actually. We have super mean as well on this top side. Never good. Ult, oh, that's max range now, but. Like, even when I do ult someone, there's just no follow up. I want to kill the turret, but it's not really worth it. Not really in the position to do so. I'm just going to drop my ward on Baron just in case they do it. Potentially, there's a steal available, but obviously, I don't have smite, which just makes. Ten times harder, but um, and try and keep some vision. Is we just <laughs> is there any ward we have on this map? Oh wait, he has finally dropped a ward. Fine. I need magic resist as well. I need how you know I need so many things because of how fed they are at the moment. I need a lot of things, but I just can't afford it because they're just snowboarding a lot quicker than. Oh. Yeah. Can we make someone happen here? Not if I get caught like that. 
I can't believe I've walked into that. What is? I can't believe that. That's annoying. That's annoying. Come on, make something happen. Give me some damage. Like she's using her ult when no one's even low. Like, Riven, yeah. She was never gonna. No, Vayne's just dead. Oh, what the fuck? Like, <laughs> it's a waste of her ult there. Vayne was. Um, Riven was nowhere near low enough to use her ult like that. It's just a waste. Damage. Super minions coming into our base as well. This game's over, unfortunately. Now we're just losing all the turrets. Listen, why did I have to get these pre made? Why? The diamonds are always on the enemy team, they're never on my team. It's just unfair. Really unfair. And they're going to take every turret in our base now because we just haven't have nothing to defend. We have no damage and they have su these super minions pushing to our flipping base. And it's just like, GG. I just can't chase them. If I did ult them, like, I was just like saying, like, no follow up for my team. We just have no flipping damage. Oh, me has some damage. I'm just trying to make sure I got a triple kill. I want to get a panel or something crazy. Oh, we did actually get the ace. Wow. I don't know why they come back. It seemed really stupid that they actually come back. The thing is, alright, so I'm now like, yeah, we've got an ace. Sick. Let's, let's go push, right? It's only me and Nidby for one. And we have three sets of super minions coming into our base. And we can't push because our base will just die to super minions. So, you know, basically it's now like, yeah, GG, we got an ace, but, you know, what can we do? Nothing. Just defend. <laughs> defend all these super minions that are coming into our base. Which just sucks. So hard. I probably shouldn't really flash. I was getting a bit greedy. I was just getting a bit excited that there was a potential I could have got a pentakill, but it wasn't to be. Just the trip one, fortunately. Um, so I'm going to have to get home guard boots. That was really nice though, because I got a shitload of gold out of that. Oh, a lot of gold, and all these farm I'm doing at the moment as well. It's just nice. That's what I need. This is what I need to kind of get into the game, but it's too late now though. It's just kind of like, when do they finish instead of, like, how? The waiting game, really, unfortunately. Now, um, I get my war mugs and my home guard boots, which is really nice. So, yeah, it really went in my favor that fight. Well, for me, anyway. Makes me pretty strong now, really. But, you know, I need mad resist and I need more armor now. That means I can't get any more damage. It's alright building me damage, but, you know, the team relies on me to really to be the tank, to be honest, which I didn't kind of. Take the, well, I took my top lane, ruined the masteries this game. Purely as I didn't want to be the tank, which was like, damn it. But. Hey, yeah. Uh, what can you do, hey? I don't want to get I need to get something. I build in the meantime. Nothing, really. All these super minions. All these super minions. Like, what the fuck? Please. Put more super minions in my day. I even heal by just anyone will do right now. You know, they sort of dying because of it. Oh, this sucks. Too many flipping soup minions. Oh, that. Not that. Really? Fuck you all. Fuck you, Lisa. <laughs> Fuck you all. Um, I don't know what to say about that, unfortunately. Well, I did alright in the top lane, you know, thanks to a nice gank by Jinx at the start. Oh, whatever, I can't remember what happened. Oh no, yeah, I got first blood because of my own, because Lee Soon came and I still killed Rebel, and we had a lot of nice damage, but then she was just life them quite nicely. But yeah, I felt stronger than her, um, just unfortunately my team just wasn't as good as what their team was, really. We had no damage, we literally just had no damage. 
So unfortunately, I didn't get to beat the Diamond 1 Cassiopeia. Had I been mid lane, I would have fucked her up. Um, but yeah, they just bring more to the team, really, Cassiopeia's ult, and really we didn't have anything like that. The only initiation we had was really my ult, and, and even when I, whenever I did ult, no one, there was just no damage to follow up. Like when we tried, when I ulted Cassiopeia, our top lane, uh, tier, the tier 2 turret, um, there was just no follow up, nothing, um, which really sucked, and that was it really. And that was the kind of sign of things to be, but, so yeah, and the Diamond 1 gets away with this game. Well, they're never on my team, which just sucks. I always get like the flipping bronze one Alistar on my team. But there we go. Not to worry. It's cool. I just want some diamonds. There's no love for me. It doesn't bother. It doesn't matter. It's, it's all good, you know. At the end of the day, we did what we. I did what I had to do in the top lane, really. But unfortunately, um, we just didn't have the team. Just didn't win anywhere else, really. So we just didn't have the damage. And Vayne just was just had nothing for her, really, young. But there we go. Um, nevertheless, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Take it easy. Have a good day. Peace.